hello and thank you for stopping by. If you are a subscriber, welcome back. If you are not a subscriber, please hit that subscribe button so you can be notified when new videos arrive. The next stimulus check. It would target the next payment in almost every way. What's in the new targeted stimulus check proposal and why are some lawmakers warning that a $1,400 check it would go to too many people? Too far and to too many people. We'll explain what's happening and exactly how Congress could prune the recipient list. This is from CNET. That's what I'm reading from. So if it sounds like I'm reading from something, I am reading from something. If a group of 10 Republican senators has its way, America's third stimulus check would look completely different than the two payments that came before. Specifically, it would be more targeted to send a COVID-19 relief payment of up to 1000 per person to people whose yearly income falls below a certain bracket. President Joe Biden met with a group on Monday to discuss their $600 billion vision of the next stimulus bill, about a third of Biden's $1.9 trillion plan. Biden, his initial package for the next stimulus check, on the other hand, sets a $1,400 maximum payment per person and would allow millions to either qualify for the first time or get more money per household. Biden and the Republican senators met Monday, each hopeful they would reach a resolution. However, in Biden's camp, while upbeat about finding common ground, also said it would not slow down the work on its urgent crisis response and will not settle for a package that fails to meet the moment, according to a White House statement released Monday night. Any change, big or small, could have an enormous impact on how many people would ultimately ultimately receive a payment a payment now joe biden wants to bring out a $1400 payment there's some republicans that think we should do $1000 now a lot of people say it's only for it's only $400 difference but that $400 difference could really stack up to a lot of money if uh, you think about it. While Democrats could, could potentially push a bill through without Republican support through budget reconciliation, some of Biden's aides have reportedly questioned the breadth of the stimulus package, including the $1,400 stimulus check. Biden himself has said he's open to negotiating the moving target of the stimulus check details, a fact demonstrated by meeting with the Republicans. We'll explain what a objection is to a $1,400 stimulus check and how it could potentially become more targeted. We'll continue to update the story with new information. Okay, they want to slim the bill down, the Republicans, they're they're saying they want to be responsible, but I think what's going on is that they want to um, drag their feet. How the $600 billion GOP proposal could remake the third stimulus check, how it would remake it. Here's the quick snapshot. Supply a $1,000 stimulus check maximum instead of $1,400. Lower the minimum qualifying income limit to $50,000 for single people and $100,000 per married couple. Further, change the stimulus check formula to reduce the number of people who could get a partial payment and provide $500 for eligible dependents of any age. Yep, why some people want the next stimulus payment to be targeted. The argument here is that a $1,400 per person maximum would send millions of stimulus checks to people who are already considered higher earners. 
in addition to sending the full 1400 upper limit to many tens of millions of people who fit into the sweet spot that Congress wants to supply with stimulus money. Yes, that is true. There are going to be some people that will receive a stimulus payment that do not need the money. All they're going to do is just stick it in the bank and it's not going to do nothing. Either that or they're going to take that money and they're going to donate it to their local charity and they will take a tax write-off for donating that money. The ones that actually need the money, people that are on minimum wage, people that are low earners that are have major bills that have families, people that are on Social Security and SSI, those people do get a check every month. So they're not hurting for money that way because they're used to whatever they're getting. They're used to getting that every month. Their money has not been cut off, but it does help out in a pinch, especially because of the seriousness of the COVID. Now, when you've got people that are making enough money to where their finances have not been hurt, their bills are still being paid every month, they are not out of any money, they are not in uh, distress, or they are not potentially headed to the poorhouse, they don't need that stimulus check. But how do you weed those people out? How do you separate everybody? Uh, it would be very difficult to do that when... You have to really get this out quick. So the best way to do it is just send it all out to everybody and hope for the best. There's going to be some people that may send it back because they don't need it. Those are the honest people. But let's face it, when you're given free money, are you really going to send that back? I don't really think so. There is a few that will, but for the most part, even the ones that can't stand Joe Biden, even the ones that say Joe Biden is not their president, if it is sent out and Joe Biden's name is attached to it, I can guarantee you they will spend it. So, how do you feel about it? The new stimulus package, the $1,400. Do you think it should be 1000 Do you think it should be 1400 Do you honestly believe that that's not going to do any good? Either way, do you think that uh, bills have been backed up so much that $1,400 is not going to do any good, that it's only going to dig us into a deeper hole. I'm kind of torn on it. I think that the $1,400 is not enough to do anything. I think it is better than nothing. But $1,400 is a drop in the bucket. There was a time in my life where I would take, I'd take that much money, go out to dinner, go out shopping for clothes, go to a movie and come home, 1400 would be gone just like that. So what do we do? Do we accept it or do we um, try to dig ourselves out of our own hole? Apparently the government, although they're doing what they say that they think they can do, we're still stuck in a hole. If you have any ideas for this, if you know how to fix it, or if you've got plans on what you're going to do with your stimulus check, put it down there in the comment below. I'd love to hear from you. Also, if you think um, you know of something that will work that nobody else has thought about, put it down there in the comment. If you'd like to uh, give my video a thumbs up, please do so. Hit the thumbs up and the like. Also, if you would like to subscribe, hit the subscribe button right down there. I would greatly appreciate it. I'm going to let you go on this note. Remember, make tomorrow better than yesterday by doing the very best we can today. My hat's off to everybody, America, and the world around us. Keep us safe, and may we get back to some semblance of normal. Have a good afternoon, America and all points beyond.